Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thank you for asking me, can a cop search my car even if I say no? Can they? Sure. On the roadside, a cop can do pretty much whatever he or she wants. Whether or not the search is lawful is going to be another question entirely. Traffic stops are considered detentions and they implicate the Fourth Amendment. Accordingly, they're limited in scope to their purpose, and that is to write you a ticket. But if anything happens during the course of that limited detention, which gives an officer a reasonable and articulable suspicion that you're engaged in criminal behavior, then you can be further detained, and the officer is entitled to further investigate so as to confirm or dispel his reasonable suspicion. Note that a bare hunch is not enough to transform a routine traffic stop into a full-blown criminal investigation. But if there's more, like for instance, the smell of alcohol on your breath, the smell of marijuana emanating from your vehicle, or something in plain view like an open container or a pill or a severed human head, then the police can and they will investigate. But in order to conduct a constitutionally permissible search, a police officer is going to need either one, your consent, two, probable cause, for instance, a canine alert to search the vehicle, three, probable cause to arrest you, after which they can conduct an inventory search of your vehicle, or four, a warrant. There are other exceptions, but generally that's the law. And again, on the roadside, the only real law is the guy or the gal with the gun and the badge. And in the real world, we know that sometimes cops do what they want to do, not what they are lawfully required to do. It's almost always going to behoove you to be polite and be respectful. If you're asked and you decline to give permission to a search, then do so pleasantly. And if you feel that you're being mistreated, then ask for a supervisor to be dispatched to the scene. And if the cop is being a complete douchebag, then dial 911 yourself, right there from the roadside, advise dispatch that you believe that your rights are being violated, and ask for a supervisor to be sent to the scene. But remember, be polite, that call's being recorded, and it will be admissible in evidence against you. Thank you again for your question. I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember at Michael A. Haber, PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, please subscribe. We'll be putting out more soon.